Welcome back to our channel here at EVA's Marketplace News. My name is Alex and I'm your host for today. Now, um, here, guys, I do have a very interesting topic for you today. Now, as a Filipina, I'm, um, I feel that I have a big part of this one. And as a fan of cryptocurrency, all right? here's it is really a big deal and a big thing so i know that for everyone who's watching just stay tuned all right and i'll give you the details um in a bit but before that i just want to say um thank you so much for watching my videos and for watching our videos in our channels um just keep on subscribing and keep on tuning in daily all right so guys here news for today philippine crypto valley to attract companies from japan korea and australia so this is brought to us by pcn or preferred currency news so the philippine government owned kagayan economic zone authority has unveiled a plan to attract japanese korean and australian companies to its crypto valley of asia um, the authority is also cracking down on crypto companies operating within its economic zone without a license. Um, CZS Crypto Valley of Asia. The Kagayan, um, the Kagayan Economic Zone Authority announced last week its plan to attract companies from Japan, Korea, and Australia to its Crypto Valley of Asia. Um, CISA has partnered with one of its principal offshore virtual currency exchange licenses, Rare Earth Asia Technologies Corp, to achieve this expansion. The agreement gives the tech company the exclusive right um, to be CESA's sole marketing and technical partner to promote CESA in the aforementioned three countries, the authority explained. So Crypto Valley of Asia will be marketed as the most ideal investment destination in Asia for blockchain. Crypto and financial technology companies, Cesar wrote, the authority further noted that it offers companies clear guidelines and transparency, attractive tax incentives, access to a rich, uh, rich pool of talent in the areas of blockchain and fintech, and other benefits elaborating. The development plan for the Crypto Valley of Asia includes the launch of blockchain and fintech university to provide skilled and experienced workers for companies in the economic zone. So on November 23, the Philippine News Agency reported that CISA's revenue from January to September reached 521 million pesos, that's $10 million, <clears throat> doubling from 224.55 million pesos earned for the full year of 2017. CESA CEO and Administrator Raul Lambino explained that CESA's venture into cryptocurrency on blockchain technology has boosted its revenue this year, adding that growth in the economic zone will be investment driven furthermore about 50,000 jobs will be created the news outlet noted rare earth will also be issuing a token that enables its exchange partners to receive a share of transaction fees cesa added this initiative shall be subject to cesa fintech and of uh, of C rules and regulations as well as its upcoming framework and regulations on ICO and STO. In addition, <clears throat> Cesar wrote, as part of the agreement with Cesar, Rare Earth will comply with all the Philippine rules and regulations of the concerned regulatory agencies such as the Banco Central of the Nang Pilipinas and Securities and Exchange Commission when appropriate. All right, so um, the Manila Times reported on November 22 that CISA is cracking down on cryptocurrency firms operating in the zone between without 
zone without authorization. CISA is collaborating with the National Bureau of Investigation and the Criminal Investigation and Detection Group of the Philippine National Police to go after unlicensed crypto businesses. The authority has also issued an order to closely monitor activities in its Crypto Valley program. The news outlet wrote, according to Lombino, there have been reports of some unlicensed cryptocurrency firms that have borrowed in CISA's emerging fintech crypto hub where they set up illegal operations. In October, CISA announced that it had awarded licenses to 19 companies, allowing them to operate crypto businesses within the zone. What do you think of CISA attracting companies from Japan, Korea, and Australia to its crypto valley of Asia? Let us know in the comment section below. All right, so guys, that has been the most interesting topic for me. All right, but in fairness, it's it's one of the trending topic um, in the crypto world right now. Okay, so guys, please visit preferredcurrency.news for more news and updates. Okay, now you can subscribe now, so yeah, that you will be the first one to get notified of the updates. So. Guys, you can use your PayPal for a monthly recurring for only $15 per month fiat. Or you can use the Coinbase option for $180 annual subscription that's to be paid with your favorite crypto. Now, if you will subscribe, you will be getting our newsletter each and every day. Each day. Okay. Now, on the newsletter, um, of course, the articles of the day. All right. Now, guys, um, we have a part of the newsletter that cannot be found anywhere else on the internet. It's specially for you. Here. Ta-da! So, this is the dessert for the day. Donald's research list. Okay? So, let me show you. Just click spread, excuse me, spreadsheet. It will take you there. Here. This is the Donald's research list again. It cannot be found or it cannot be researched anywhere else on the internet, but only here at Preferred Currency News. Now, let me show you. Let me tour you to the Donald's research list. So, guys, first, first column. Um, these are the names of the tokens and coins. It's a complete list, all right? Now, maybe you're asking what does the letter mean? What do these letters, I mean, colors mean? Red have negative news, orange, tan are neutral, yellow are fair, green have good news, and blue are showing the best news, okay? So when you subscribe to Preferred Currency News, you can have it all. You can have this, you can have the news updates, right? You can have um, also websites to visit so that um, you will know where and what and how, okay, in the crypto world. So really guys, all is there. And we will be sending you the newsletter via email every day, 12 hours before we post videos here on YouTube. But uh, for your information, this newsletter, okay, or this spreadsheet is not a recommendation to buy or sell, okay? We believe that you must research each token that you would like to research and then you can decide after. All right, so here, let me show you. Uh, let's not go far. Let's talk about Bitcoin as of November 27, 2018. Now, Bitcoin's recent price is 3,802.8244157. Share of total market volume is 0 0.3362 Google searches compared to the past seven days, 61%. 50 candle SMA movement crossing down 50 number of positive technical indicators for 24 hours volume versus price zero seven days volume versus price it's 1.6 and 30 days monthly volume versus price 2.1 and lastly percent issued it's 82.83 percent all right now for now i i want to know the status or the update of, of ea so there's an easier way to find or to look for the token just um, click Control f and then type down eos there 
So for EOS recent price, it's 3.22494062. Um, share of total market volume, it's 0 0.053242036565% for Google searches uh, compared to the past 7 days. It's also crossing down 50, number of positive technical indicators for a 24 hours current volume versus price 0, 7 days volume versus price 1.11. 30 days volume versus price 3.45 and percent issued it's 90.06 percent so guys there you go that easy okay that easy that um it's really easy to understand but i have a tip okay if you can see here there are colors okay like eos let's do that again okay where's eos okay here so like eos guys you can see a lot of blue and a lot of green in its row so meaning this coin is um doing well all right it's it has a good status all right so guys again you must do your own research because we are not financial advisors so we really recommend that you do your own research uh, with the tokens and then you can decide afterwards all right so please guys again visit preferred currency dot news and you can subscribe so that you will be the first one to get notified all right now thank you so much for joining me in this video please leave your comments down below and don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe okay bye